I'm not going to lie to you. This has been on this roundabout in Lincoln for about five years. And I've been past this 50 times and I've never seen it. I've never looked at it. It's the size of an house. You can't miss it, can you? As it says on the sign, Lincoln, birthplace of the tank. Yeah. And this year is the 100th anniversary of the tank being a success in a battle situation. So what we're going to do, we're going to replicate one, we're going to get it running, we're going to have a word with the council, and fingers crossed, we're going to drive it up the main street of Lincoln on Remembrance Day, November the 11th. 11 o'clock on November the 11th. I am impressed. Without the tank, they would never have won the bloody war. Someone nicked the clutch out of it. You have just to imagine, it's not a wave, it's a tsunami of tanks. Tsunami of tanks. Come on, come on, lap it. <laughs> got plenty of bird action. I think this is all part of it. This is all part of it. Whoa! Well, it's not a one, huh? Congeal fat. This is the future, isn't it? I keep wanting to come stroke it. Why are we building the tank? But I think it's important to remember the people that died in the First World War. I mean, bloody hell, there's like 18 million that died. 